Hi everyone, sorry for the lack of updates recently, but we've been super busy moving yards and getting settled in our new homes. I'll show you around. This is the stables. And over here is Caston. All the horses are out at the moment. Over here, we've got the solarium wash box, hay, very important. So moving on to outside, we've got a horse walker, very handy in the winter. And over here is our arena and all the jumps. And then grazing. So for those of you who didn't hear, um, I've quit my full-time job and I'm now running a yard at Upper Farm. And we've moved all the horses in and the last two months we've just been trying to settle into our new routine. Whose great idea was it for me to quit my office job in winter? It's been freezing, although at least it's nice and dry. I've had lots of opportunity to test my new saddle and I've even got some of the liveries to have a go and members of staff as well. So far, everyone's a big fan. We had our first clear round at Christmas. See if you can spot the solution saddle banner. And then we went for a yard Christmas ride. We discovered since Flory's changed shape and developed more muscle, she needed a breastplate, especially when jumping and going up the hills. Here she is, testing it out. It's made a huge difference. Her saddle no longer slips when we jump or go up the big hills, which is great. Meanwhile, caston has been busy getting back to work after his injury. Here's the first time jumping a course since he was injured. As you can see, he managed to jump straight back into it and wasn't green at all. As you can see, I'm testing out my new Smart Pro saddle in this video. And if you look at my lower leg position over the fences, it's a lot better. It hasn't got the swinging effect that I used to have in my older saddle. So far, using this saddle, I found it to be a lot more supportive when I'm jumping and it's a lot better at helping me keep my position and maintain my position over the fences. As you can see in the video, Caston's starting to tire as this was his first proper course and he has a little pole down. But apart from that, he jumped fab. Caston and I also headed off to the gallops last week to help improve his fitness as he comes back into work. Here he is with his friend Rav. In the meantime, we've been busy trying to build a few extra stables for them all. In this video clip, you can see us practicing our straightness using poles, raised poles and poles on the ground. It's really good for the youngsters and gets their brains really thinking. As well as grid work, and here Caston demonstrates he's starting to get the hang of where his feet are. <laughs> 